Before diving into all of the videos here inside the Z Classroom, let's take a brief look at what working inside ZBrush is all about. If you are new to ZBrush, you may not realize that you will be creating art within two powerful and unique environments. A 3D environment, which is used for creating, sculpting, and painting on 3D models. And a 2.5D environment, which can be used for illustration, as well as many other forms of art. Even though there are way too many professional fields using the 3D tools inside ZBrush to name in a single video, chances are if you like watching movies or playing video games, you've already seen tons of ZBrush work. And the same goes with the 2.5D tools and features within ZBrush. There are countless illustrations and works of art that you likely see every day that have been created in this unique world that walks the line between 2D and 3D. Both of these environments have been designed to work together and are driven by ZBrush's core technology, the Pixel. Pixels exist within XYZ space, contain color, material, and lighting information. Now before I go too far and get into all the advanced tools and features of ZBrush, let's take a moment to explore a few more videos that are designed to help you build a strong foundation and prepare you for more advanced tutorials.